Hello and welcome to Quick Tips, the WordPress video series. In this video, I'm going to install the WordPress CRM plugin. Using this plugin, you can create unlimited email marketing campaigns on your own WordPress website. You can create automatic funnels. Using this plugin, you can create forms on your website. These forms will collect the data from the customers and you can use that customer data to run the email marketing campaign for your business. Let me show you an example of the contact form. So this is the form that I have created using this plugin. When someone put the information here and subscribe, it will create a contact in the list. Now you can use this information to run the email marketing campaign. Now there is no limitation. You can have n number of campaigns and you can create a big list of users. If you are using WooCommerce on your website, there is an automatic funnel which will help you create the contact list of the buyers from your website. So it will create the contact list of the buyers and you can use that contact list to run the automatic email campaign. This plugin will create the email marketing campaign on your own WordPress website. So you do not need to go to any third party website to run the email marketing campaigns. There are many third party websites where you can run the email marketing campaign. However, you need to pay monthly fees to run the email marketing campaigns. And definitely there are limitations to use the number of campaigns now this plugin is going to handle the email marketing campaign on the WordPress website itself. So you don't need to go to any other third party website. Now this is not a free plugin. It is a paid plugin. In this video, I'll show you how to install this plugin and how to create the form, how to add the contact list and how to create the email marketing campaign. So let's see how does this work. Do not forget to subscribe to Quick Tips YouTube channel. Watch new videos about website design, e-commerce websites, search engine optimization, social media marketing, WordPress tutorials, video editing tips and many more. Press the bell icon to get instant notification whenever we publish new videos. So here I'm logged into the dashboard of the WordPress website and now I'm going to install the WordPress CRM plugin. Now this plugin will help me to create the CRM on my own WordPress website so I do not need to go to any third party website to control or manage the email marketing campaigns. Now let me show you the website from where I'm going to install this CRM plugin. So the name of the plugin is Next CRM. I'll give you the link in the description box. If you want to buy this plugin, you can use my link to purchase this plugin. Now let me give you the brief introduction to this plugin. This is the WordPress email marketing automation and campaigns. It will give you the CRM feature on your website, active leads. So you can run the contact forms on your website and these contact forms will collect leads. So here you will see contact management, lead tracking, email marketing. The plugin allows you to run automatic email marketing campaigns by creating an effective email list, customization, sales tracking. So these are the features, show overall, campaign review, manage contacts, import export, list tags segmentation forms so you can create forms on your website and using these forms you can collect the data from the customers or the visitors it is also compatible with woocommerce so you can gather the email list of the woocommerce buyers and use that list for the email marketing campaign so here you can create your own campaigns so enable the required feature if you want to collect wordpress visitors new contacts or new register users here you will see subscriber report list overview you can manage contacts contact email you can create forms here you will see subscription forms you can create campaign report campaign so you can see the report of the campaign new users bound set everything will be shown here here you will see WooCommerce orders. It will gather the information from WooCommerce customers. These are the extra modules that you will need to install along with this plugin. Comment, form, subscription, WordPress user subscription. So this is how it works. Create contact list, send emails, set automated funnels and sequenced emails. Turn the leads and send campaigns. So these are the extra features. WooCommerce order, WordPress registration, you will see opt-in forms, email listing, you can import and export the list, campaigns, email campaigns, standard campaigns, automated campaigns, templates, 
here you can see the comparison with another plugin this is fluent crm and the price of this plugin is 499 per year this is not a lifetime pricing this is a per year and the next crm pricing is 399 this is for the business pack you can start with the personal pack that you can buy at 99 dollars only this is the comparison list what is available in this one and what is available in this one you can also integrate mailchimp elementor woocommerce get response now let me show you the pricing here you can see the pricing the personal pack is available for 99 dollars and this is a lifetime plan so you do not need to pay annually if you want to go with the annual plan it will cost you 49 dollars this is the personal pack only for one website the business pack for six websites and developer pack for unlimited websites there are some additional features for this business and developer pack here you can see that lifetime free support one usage one domain usage manage unlimited list for listing your customers unlimited campaigns automated schedule campaigns campaign reports manage contacts so you can create unlimited contacts because it is going to be installed on your own website so there is no limitation for the campaigns or list of emails i'll give the link in the description box you can compare different packs and you can go for the pack whichever is suitable for your need so i already have this plugin so i'm going to the dashboard of this website so here i can see my account and if i go to downloads these are the plugins that i have next crm so i'm going to download this so i have already downloaded this plugin and i'm going to install it now so let's go back to the dashboard go to plugins and click on add new i'm going to upload it click browse and next crm plugin click on install now it is installed now click on actuate plugin all right so the plugin has been activated now here you will see the option next crm go to dashboard first we will need to activate the plugin so here you will see active license okay so i need to activate the plugin so i'm going to my account here and here you will see the option license and this is next crm i'm going to click on license and first i need to enter i need to register my domain here so i'm going to register my domain and i'm going to copy the license key all right so i'm going to use this license key here and click on active license all right so it says successfully active license for this domain okay now i'm going to dashboard so this is the dashboard of the next crm this is the subscriber overview right now we do not have any subscriber we have just installed this plugin here you will see contacts it will show all the contacts forms we are going to create one form this is campaign if you are running campaign you can see all the campaigns here here you will see all contacts list tags segment forms automatic funnel is there from here you can create automatic funnel now here you will see settings business settings you can enter your business information here so i'm going to business settings so it will take the information from your website you can edit your information here enter the business address your business email address will be used in emails click save general settings so these are the general settings auto create users automatically create wp users so if someone register on your website then it will create the user automatically email settings so this will be the redirect url if someone unsubscribe then it will go directly to let's say i'm going to use home page integration if you want to integrate with mailchimp active campaign get response you can use the integration setup here 
so these are the SMTP settings easy SMTP easy to use tool for improving email deliverability the most functional and lightweight PHP SMTP mail plugin so this is an extra plugin you can install it is a free plugin this is for the SMTP REST API so you can use APIs with another website all right let's go to forms and create one form here let's see how does this work so I'm going to click on add new test form so let's name it as test form whatever name you want you can enter the name here so right now we do not have any list here form settings enable email address placeholder will be email address so this, these are the form fields email address first name last name phone date of birth if you do not want you can you can uncheck this option so I want a phone number so I'm going to enable it I want last name so these are the form fields that I want I do not want this one so I'm going to uncheck it all right so these are the form fields that I want message settings successfully mail listed already mail listed so I'm going to keep it as it is however if you want to change you can change it so this is the button text subscribe pop-up settings I'm not going to enable pop-up you can enable the pop-up if you want so these forms will be popped up so I'm going to leave it as it is for now and click on add okay so now let's close it and this is the short code okay so I'm going to copy it now let's go to one of the pages and I'm going to use this on one of the pages so I have one demo page here and I'm using Elementor on this website so I'm going to edit this page using Elementor so let me delete this section from the demo page so let me add one more section here all right so here I'm going to add the short code if you are using a Gutenberg or any other page builder you can use the short code feature so I'm going to paste the short code here unless updated you can customize this form later so I'm going to just show you how to use it so let's view the page all right so this is the form so I'm going to enter some details here all right so I'm going to click on subscribe now and it says successfully mail listed all right now let's go back to the next CRM dashboard and let me refresh it let's go to dashboard let's go to contacts so here I'm trying to refresh but I do not see any contact list added here so let's see I have a list here so I guess the form is not added to any list so we will create a list so here under contacts go to list and click on add new name it as test list or whatever name you want you can add the name here click add okay so we have created one list let's go to tags and create a tag name it as of now I'm using test tags click add all right so we have got the list and tags let's go to forms this is the form that we have created click on edit and from here select list and select the tag so we have assigned the list and the tags for this form let's click on update now let's go back to this page I'm going to refresh it all right now I see the information is already there I'm going to subscribe it now successfully mail listed let's go to next CRM dashboard go to contacts let's refresh it now I can see the email is listed here if I want to see I can see I can click on it view and I can see the details of the user notes activities if you want to edit you can simply click edit here you can add more information for that contact 
address line city phone zip everything is there you can do it manually custom fields list it is listed to test list if you want to add the list you can click on add and you can add it to another list so this is the basic information lead customer if you want to delete you can click delete and you can delete from here now let's go to campaigns and here you can add campaigns for your email marketing let's try this one click on add new and this is the test campaign and here you can add the content from here you can use dynamic symbols like first name last name this is the list you can select the list or you can select you can exclude the list so for this campaign you are going to use this list if you want to select tags you can select the tags send the information this is your campaign subject here you can enter your campaign subject from email and from name this is settings auto schedule if you want to schedule it the campaign at particular time or date you can auto schedule the campaign maximum email limit per day it is set to 500 so whatever your email limit from your hosting service provider you can enter that email limit here so as of now it shows 500 so it is going to send 500 emails and whatever content you want you can enter the content here and once done you can click add and it is going to create a campaign for you now here you will see the option automatic funnel so if you want to use automatic funnels you can create automatic funnels using this plugin wordpress user so once someone sign up wordpress website it is going to send the email automatically email create new contacts click to enable the automatic email comment form subscription if someone comments on your website then it will send an email to that user so this is kind of automatic funnel creation on your website woocommerce order settings collect and segment email contacts from woocommerce checkout and send emails run funnels segment so you need to enable it so here you can see once i enable you will see this option here assign list map order completed pending payment so you can use this option from here here you will see click to enable automatic email automatically send email after completed woocommerce order so once the woocommerce order is completed it is going to send an email to that user purchase confirmation default user this is the default email templates you can set another templates here you will see the content now let's go to modules here and these are the modules that you can purchase WooCommerce with next campaign. So the next campaign integrates with WooCommerce to list your customers for email campaigns. So these are the extra additional plugins that you can use along with the next CRM. The price is not high. So if you want to run effective email marketing campaign, then you can definitely go for this next CRM plugin. So if you are using third party email marketing tools, you need to pay every month and there are definitely some limitations. Here you can have unlimited email marketing campaigns, unlimited subscription forms. You can have unlimited number of users or the list because everything is going to be run on your own website. So this is a WordPress CRM plugin, not a third party plugin. Once again, you can compare the pricing of different packs here. And I think you can start with the personal pack. You can try it on one of your website and see if that works. If that works, then you can upgrade to the business pack or the developer pack. So I'll give you the link in the description box. If you want to buy this plugin, use my link to purchase this plugin. So that's it for now. See you in the next video. Do not forget to subscribe to my channel to get more quick tips about online softwares and tools. If you have any questions, please leave us message in comment section and press the like button if you like the video. Thanks for watching Quick Tips.